Hello, hello. How is everyone doing? Does it, <laughs> how's everyone doing? Hello. So happy Friday. DJI Friday. I can't sing. Hello, hello. DJI Friday. Okay, guys. Um, if you if you're on here live, join me live here. If you're watching a replay, drop in a comment, replay live, whatever, wherever you are. Let me know where are you watching from. And uh, hi, Michelle. Let me know where are you watching from and how does the weather look like to you? How is the weather? Hi, Roy. Let me know how is the weather. It's beautiful weather in Vegas and it's like a mid 60s right now. Love the glasses. Ooh, I know this is like a man bow here. <laughs> Like you know, I don't have a man purse, but I have a man bow here. <laughs> Love the glass. Oh, thank you so much. Mm. Oh, yeah. Live, 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 live. Thank you, thank you, guys. Hello there. Drop in the comments. How is the weather like? What What does your weather look like? It's mid sixties here. It's sunny. It was windy and cold for the past two days, but today is a little be better. Oh, that's great. Kansas rain, but sixties. That's cool. We don't get much rain here, but we love to have rain. But I think it rained Saturday, last Saturday, but I missed it. I was in San Diego, but we had rain there. But, yeah, I had a great fruitful. It was a very, very busy week this week. I was so busy. I can't tell you, but it's in a good way. It's it's it's, it's good to be busy. I was very busy uh, taking the kids around here, their events, um, you know, speaking. Uh, doing events at different places, so I was pretty busy. My my schedule is packed jam, but I'm glad I'm busy. Hi, Deanne. Uh, hello, ladies. Drop in the comments, guys, wherever you are from. Drop in the comments where are you watching from. And how does the weather look like? And uh, how was your day? Let me know. How was your Friday? How did you start your day? What did you guys do? I mean, um, I dropped the kids about me. I dropped the kids in the morning to school. I run errands. I went to the grocery. I got a few things. So I don't like to go on the weekends. So I did my grocery for today, for the whole week. Um, and, uh, oh, the kids' class went so fantastic. It was amazing. The kids love. You know what I did? The kids, uh, I had little uh, fake fruits and vegetables as a, you know, to play the games. So I did the traffic lights by Dr. Sears, like the traffic lights, red, uh, green, and yellow. So what are the bad foods, the alert foods, which goes with the red, like steak, meat. Um, then the green foods are vegetables, which are micronutrients, which you need for your body, fruits and vegetables, rainbow. And then yellow was uh, stop and go, like you think, like ice creams, pastries, um and uh, you know uh, ice cream pastries donuts all these are stop think and go so these were the thing i did with the kids yesterday the first graders and they loved it and then i had a little mini parts for each child we have 28 kids so for each child i had a little pot with the soil and then i put the little mung beans have you heard about mung beans um i soaked the mung beans overnight the previous day and then i gave the seeds uh, to each child like eight seeds and they planted those seeds into their little potting soil uh, in the potting soil and they are going to see how it sprouts so they know they're going to eat what they grow right so giving kids uh, empowering them with knowledge and giving them uh, a sense of responsibility so they can know what they're growing and they can eat what they what they grow that's what we did in the class yesterday it was so much fun and the kids loved it and kids loved it and they said mrs burton mrs burton oh my plants my seed it's so cute today they're telling me mrs burton my plant my seedling hasn't sprouted yet i said give it a time it takes three to four days sometimes depending on the kind of seeds it takes a while to sprout so that was a thing it was amazing i was tired i, I crashed i can tell you when i came home i totally crashed I was so tired. I slept for two hours. And guess what? After I woke up, my whole house was a mess. Because my, since I was tired, I took a nap. My kids trashed the whole place. The popcorn was all over. The beddings were all messed up. They're fighting. The pillows were all over. <laughs> but it's okay. It was a long day, fruitful day. But it was very tiring yesterday. And I crashed. I crashed. And today is a busy day too. Uh, I have to take my uh, oldest one to the basketball game and then the little one to the birthday party. So it's a very busy, busy day today. 
um, and tomorrow my oldest has a chess competition, state level chess competition. is going to be busy. So the 10 year old has a chess competition. So wish him a good luck so he does well in this chess competition. Um, and yes, yeah, so yeah, it is, it's always fun for moms, right? When you're running around, taking the kids to the soccer, basketball, and you can relate that, right? Uh, but yes, everything is a priority. So we do what we can as a mom. We try to, uh, juggle around life between home, family, home, busy life and business, right? And we do the best we can. So guys, back to, so I, this is my bonus video today about the inflammation. So let's get, get back to the topic here. We talked about the foods to eliminate all the refined sugars, uh, processed food, um, the canned foods, uh, the high uh, high fat content like corn, vegetable oil, uh, you know, because you don't want to use those because they're high in saturated fats, high in uh, trans fats, and you don't want that. And we don't want hydrogenated vegetable oil, which is in uh, donuts um, and bagels. In other kind of processed pastries okay so we these are the things which we talked about to eliminate and the things to add on i talked about you got to eat more raw foods uh eat more raw vegetables plant-based try to add more plant-based if you can if you can be completely 100 percent plant-based i highly recommend you to add more greens leafy greens like chard collard greens uh spinach full of iron vitamins magnesium uh, add to your daily diet. You can juice it. You can spruce it however you want. Uh, vegetable soups, stew or whatever you want. But just add lots of green veggies. If you eat raw, it's great. Kale, it's hard for body to digest eating too much raw kale. If it muscle nicely into uh, a little lime juice and other stuff, then it's great. Uh, otherwise, kale is hard to digest. So kale, cabbage, spinach, um, full of potassium. The bananas is so good for you. Adding bananas to diet. The nuts are good, but not in too much quantity. Uh, nuts like walnuts, chia seeds, uh, flax seeds are great. So you can add those. We talked about. And today I'm going to talk about how to gain your energy. So these are the five things. Number one is adding greeny leaves. Number five, right? I'm going to talk about adding more raw green leaves. Number two, adding nuts. Uh, third is uh, vegetables. Um, and bananas. Bananas gives you a lot of energy. Magnesium, potassium is great for you. Um, number four is adding probiotics to your diet. Probiotics. Probiotics, as I talked about, what is probiotic? What your thoughts on asparagus? Asparagus is good for you, but I don't know if somebody, some people like beets, they can be gassy. And the asparagus is good. I mean, there's no harm in asparagus. It's a plant, right? So there's nothing harm in asparagus. So you can eat them. Make sure they, if you can find organic is great. If not, um, you don't want those dirty dozens, right? With, with pesticides and chemicals. Getting rid of all, number four is getting rid of all your toxins and chemicals. Like shampoos, um, the soaps. If I have chemicals, you don't want to eliminate those things. Getting rid of the toxins. Detoxing your body. It's very good at least once in every two months it's good to detox your body cleanse completely get rid of the toxins the thing we breathe we inhale the food we pitch in our body getting rid of the fast food the chemicals the toxins everything okay so detox every couple of months or every three months is great uh 10 day detox and i said i do a 10 day shred detox completely with three things lemons apple cider vinegar brags and number three is uh, cranberry juice is optional, pure cranberry juice because it helps clear, flood the toxins from your kidneys. So if you're interested, I would love to have you in my 10-day group. We uh, start the challenge on Monday and you will see that you have lost a few pounds easily, like three to four pounds easily. In five. I have people who have lost five pounds in 10 days and I had a lady and I will bring her on board as my speaker. She was 300 pounds. Uh, and I was able to help her over the period of 18 months to lose from 300 pounds, lose almost 150 pounds. And she was back to normal, very thin size. She was supposed to go for a bypass surgery and she, she didn't have much money, but, uh, yes, Michelle, I will help you with the 10 day shred and I will help you whatever. I will help you to detox completely your mind, body, and able to retrain your brain completely and, program your brain with uh, good information good thoughts if your body is clean your mind is clean if your body is full of toxins your body
mind is full of toxins. So get it, get rid of all the toxins before you spend thousands of dollars on expensive products, which are not going to do anything. It's like a band-aid and it's not. And then adding a lot of spices. Preston, hi. Adding a lot of spices, which is a highly recommend. I People call me as a spice queen. That's my specialty. But it's just, I would say, I'm not a queen or anything. I'm just, I grew up with a lot of spices. So turmeric, if you don't know what turmeric is, Google. Go to Whole Foods, get a, a turmeric root. Don't use a store-bought powder. But if you have some reliable sources, get the real good turmeric powder or turmeric um, root. And turmeric paste powder is no good if it's not mixed with peppercorns and the healthy fat which is coconut oil or butter okay because you need those healthy fats for your body to absorb go to the bloodstream and able to um you able to see the reduce inflammation able to see the results okay so turmeric by itself is no good if you're taking number two is adding turmeric and ginger to your teas everyday teas which is good uh, cinnamon is good. It helps reduce the blood pressure, increase your, uh, reduce the stress level, and uh, and increase your energy. So cinnamon, turmeric, and ginger. Okay. And number five is uh, having a good source of plant-based protein powder to increase your energy. Okay. To have yesterday, I was so lethargic. I was so tired because I didn't sleep well. For the past whole week, I've been just getting four to five, six hours of five hours, maybe four hours of sleep. So I crashed yesterday. So it's so important that you have at least seven hours of sound sleep and make sure that you don't eat after 7 p.m. because your body needs to be able to rest, relax. Your organs need to be relaxed after 7 p.m. So, so these are things which I'll be doing. Um, and... I have a good news for you guys. I made this energy balls. Would you like to know what are energy balls? What kind of energy balls do you do? You do you eat some kind of energy bars or whatever? Because as you know, energy bars has a lot of sugar, and I don't buy any store brought uh, energy bars. I make my own homemade energy balls. I will share with you. See this? I made these energy balls. It has like fifty ingredients in there, and I didn't put the fifty ingredients in there. It already came in a pack and I made this amazing ball. It takes only 10 minutes, less than 10 minutes to put together. I made like 12 balls, energy balls, in less than 10 minutes put together. On the go, it's raw. I freeze it and pop it in my mouth and just on the go. Okay, energy balls. If you want a recipe, drop in the comments recipe and I will give you the recipe for this amazing balls. Amazing balls. Mmm. Oh. To name few ingredients, it has maca powder, it has spirulina, it has flax seeds, it has, it's all plant-based, okay, there's no added sugar, it's all natural, and it gives you, gives you spark, it, it takes away brain fog, it gives you a lot of energy, mental clarity, able to detox, cleanse, when you're cleansing, these are great. If you want a recipe, drop in the comments recipe and i'll give you the recipe it's simple i didn't have a coconut so i didn't add coconut to it but you see these balls chocolate balls oh my goodness it's like in heaven oh my mm. wish you were here wish you were able to taste this but i get to tell you this this is a crowd pleaser i promise you this is a cloud pleaser if you eat this ball and serve the people you'll be a rock star you'll be a rock star eating this energy balls this is amazing. It's not rich. You can make with peanut butter too, but I have the recipe for this. Uh, I didn't have peanut butter, but I used almond butter, spirulina, maca powder. Um, and there are other things which you can add turmeric and other powder and stuff, cinnamon. You can add those little things, but I'll give you the recipe. I have lots of recipe for this. This is my specialty here, and I'll give you the recipe. Drop in the comments recipe, and I'll give you the recipe. So, this is my fifth thing is the energy balls on the go. If you're busy mom juggling, don't have time, I make this once every couple weeks and I freeze it and eat on the go. And they are like, oh, melt in the mouth energy balls. Okay, no sugar added, all natural. Mm. <laughs> okay, oh yes, you can do as a cake pops. And maybe that will be popular, Michelle. Probably 
uh, you might bake this and sell them. And this is no, uh, no bake, no bake um, pops, cake pops. And you can, this is so popular and you can make this and you can sell healthy uh, detox pop balls, you know, or it's good for, great for families, it's great for whole family, it's good for on the go. So it's a healthy balls without, without the, bad stuff okay so these are so good okay i'll give you the recipe i'll share the recipe it's so good and i do the energy sometimes I, i'm not a big shake fan uh that's why i do the protein powder if i have in the form of a balls or i can bake make pancakes or i'll make a little banana bread i do shakes but not that often but in order to have energy you can make some come up with the different ideas pancakes uh, waffles you can make you can make um, the, uh, you can make balls you can make energy bars with the protein uh, protein protein powder whatever you can so this is what I use it's chocolate Dutch chocolate oh my goodness it's the heaven so this is what I made with it's a Dutch powder and it's no sugar no refined sugar nothing it's all natural and I made those balls with those. Oh my goodness. I wish you guys were here and you could have tasted a piece of my little balls. Oh my. And cake. I would say cake pop. A health, health pop. Uh, melt in the mouth and that's amazing. So guys, you know what to do. Uh, so let me know what else are you going to... How, 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 is, how are we going to spend the rest of the evening? What are you guys doing for the evening? I, I just made a little quick meal here. I don't know whether they can see me. But it's like a curry... It's a, it's vegetarian. It's a peas, chickpeas. As you know, chickpeas is high in protein. So it's a chickpea. It's a curried chickpeas. It has turmeric, everything. It has um, the protein I'm getting into from tofu, organic tofu. Uh, and it has a chickpea, which is protein, full of protein. And it has peas. So I'm getting a five superfoods in here. Tofu, peas, uh, chickpeas. Uh, there's a, br a brown rice to it. Um, and there is, uh, and there is capsicum, which is a bell pepper, yellow. It's so good. I don't know if you can see me, but this is the color it looks like. Mm. So this is my on the go, on the go food because I have to go pick the kids up. I have a long busy day and my dessert is this protein balls. Ooh. So that's her. <laughs> Oh yes, they will be popular, Michelle. Absolutely, and you know what? Um, this is kind of another thing you can do on the side because people will fall in love with you. I promise you, you will become popular with these cake pops. And you can, you if you're creative, you can create this. I can give you ideas, and you can create this amazing with your designs, with your color scheme, and all that stuff. Whatever you want to do. Um, I have great ideas, but I'm not very creative in the hands, so I can't. Oh, yes. Uh, I, you make brownies with coconut. Oh, that's great. I can show you how to make brownies with plant-based with no eggs and other stuff. I have amazing with uh, uh, with the black beans, black beans brownies, and I'll give you the recipe for that too. They're amazing. You won't even know that they are made from black beans. No sugar. You don't have to have sugar, natural cocoa. Yes, and um, uh, you can do a raw sugar if you want, which is a palm sugar, raw palm sugar. That's okay because it's unrefined. And if you don't want to use, you can use stevia or you can use raw uh, st raw stevia or you can use maple syrup if you want, which is natural stuff. So, yeah, that's about it. And I'll give you the recipe. I hope you guys got some added value to it. Please feel free to share my videos. I'll be more than happy. I'll give you a shout out. Michelle, I really appreciate you. And I want to give you a shout out that you always comment on my post. You share my videos. Um, you send me a personal message. I really appreciate you as my friend. And I, I will add you to my 10-day shred group. And we're going to start the shredding starting Monday. And if you ain't guys interested in my 10-day shred, please drop in the comments 10. And I will add it to my 10-day shred. I'm, I'm a little behind. So give me some time to respond and add it to the group. I'd love to have you because we can do this together as an accountable partner. And we can shred some bad habits and replace with the great habits. We can ha help each other out. Um, I have a big network and I can help you with whatever you are doing. And hi, Anna. Drop in the comments, guys, where are you watching from? And uh, if you haven't watched my replay, go from the start and watch my replay. And uh, comment below. 
and let's engage uh, with each other and, 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 and you know, exchange ideas, share ideas. So if you want the recipe, drop in the comments recipe for my uh, Amaze Balls and I will give you the recipe. If you want to join my 10 day shred, drop in the comments 10 and I can add you to my... Uh, uh, thank you, Michelle. I appreciate you. You are an awesome person and I would love to get to know you more. And I already get... It looks like I already know you because uh, I appreciate you being every day generously listening to my videos. I truly appreciate you and uh, I, I can't thank you enough for being on my video and helping me sharing this video, commenting, taking your time out of your busy schedule of the bake and helping. And your son's uh, results are amazing. Your, the story you shared about your son is amazing. Thank you for sharing it. And thank you for making those healthy changes in your life and inspiring others to do the same. So let's together inspire people, many more who needs help and change lives one at a time or few at a time. So happy Friday guys, subscribe to my Facebook here, somewhere on the right, subscribe, uh, share my videos, I'll give you a shout out, give me some hearts, love, uh, comments, and uh, I'm doing a 10 day shred, so drop in the comments 10, I'll be more than happy to add you to the 10 day group, uh, and we're going to shred for 10 days, bad habits shred at a place with the great habits, okay, love you all. Uh, and check out my blog and give me some feedback success with com. I still have some changes to do a lot of things to do so success with com. just go check my blog and see maybe I can do some changes I need your feedback how I can get better how I can be, uh, you know be good and I can update myself so thank you guys have a great weekend have a blessed weekend love you all and take care okay Hasta la vista, baby. Talk to the hand. <laughs> I'm being funny, guys. Sorry. Love you all.